Recently, Niantic had given us some information about Generation 3 Pokemon being released to the game. Aside from that a brand new feature will be coming to the game as well. While this feature was John Hank's original plan for the Pokemon Go map, it appears he has finally got the funding to add it to the game. Weather conditions will be added to Pokemon Go which will bring out the best of the Pokemon that are affected by each correlated condition. Because there is so much to cover each condition will have its own section. And we will be taking a quick look at the rainy weather. What is really interesting is the game will now be able to track your weather conditions in real life who thought you could have a better. I'm playing Pokemon Go in the rain. Now you can go out and catch these three Pokemon while it's raining due to an increased spawn. Water type Pokemon will have increased spawns during a rainy day, who could have guessed that? Because Dratini is a water spawning Pokemon this blue snake should be a bit more common when it's raining outside. However, because of the water festival, it is uncertain rather or not this Pokemon's spawn will be increased. Electric type Pokemon will have an increased spawn during the rain effect. It's possible you will have a higher chance of finding electric type Pokemon in thunderstorms, though, it's not certain at this point. The last type of Pokemon that will have increased spawns during this time will be bug type Pokemon. Not certain why bug type Pokemon will be found more in the rain. However, it could have something to do with them trying to find cover from getting the wings wet. With the weather, coming to the game Pokemon that are affected by the weather will also have increased Stardust alongside higher spawn rates. Because most people don't like going out in the rain. Throw on an incense and start catching the Pokemon affected. By the weather will begin spawning from lures and incenses. At the moment with such a reduction in lures, it looks as if the map is a post-apocalyptic war zone and I'm the only survivor. 